Infamous Lady, The True Story of Countess Ursabit Bathory is a book written by Kimberly L. Craft. The book is a historical account of the life and crimes of Countess Ursabit Bathory, who is known as one of the most prolific female serial killers in history. The book is divided into several chapters that explore the Countess's life, her crimes, and her eventual capture and trial. The book begins with a brief introduction to the Countess's life and her family background. The author describes how the Bathory family was one of the most powerful and influential families in Hungary at the time and how the Countess grew up in a privileged and aristocratic environment. The author also explores the Countess's early years, her education, and her marriage to Ferenc Nadesti, a prominent military figure and member of another powerful Hungarian family. The author then delves into the Countess's descent into madness and her eventual descent into depravity. The author describes how the Countess began to indulge in various forms of sadistic behavior and how she would torture and murder young girls in her castle. The author also explores the Countess's motivations for her crimes and how she believed that bathing in the blood of virgins would keep her youthful and beautiful. Throughout the book, the author provides a vivid and detailed account of the Countess's crimes and the methods she used to torture and kill her victims. The author also explores the Countess's relationships with her accomplices, including her servants and a local witch who helped her carry out her crimes. The book also explores the Countess's eventual capture and trial. The author describes how the Countess was eventually caught by authorities and how she was brought to trial for her crimes. The author also provides a detailed account of the trial and the various testimonies that were given by witnesses, including the Countess's accomplices. Overall, Infamous Lady, the true story of Countess Ursabit Bathory is a well-written and well-researched book that provides a detailed account of the life and crimes of one of history's most notorious female serial killers. The book is written in a clear and engaging style and is accessible to both academic and non-academic readers. One of the strengths of the book is the author's attention to detail. The author provides a wealth of information about the Countess's life and crimes and does an excellent job of placing her in the context of her time and place. The author also provides a detailed account of the trial and the various testimonies that were given, which adds to the book's overall credibility. Another strength of the book is the author's exploration of the Countess's motivations. The author does an excellent job of exploring the psychological and cultural factors that may have contributed to the Countess's descent into madness and her eventual crimes. The author also explores the Countess's beliefs and how they may have influenced her behavior. One weakness of the book is that it is somewhat repetitive in places. The author tends to repeat information that has already been presented, which can be a bit tedious for the reader. Additionally, the book could benefit from more analysis and interpretation of the information presented. While the author does an excellent job of presenting the facts, she could have provided more insight into the significance of these facts. In conclusion, Infamous Lady, The True Story of Countess Ursabit Bathory is a well-written and well-researched book that provides a detailed account of the life and crimes of one of history's most notorious female serial killers. The book is accessible to both academic and non-academic readers and provides a wealth of information about the Countess's life and crimes. While the book could benefit from more, 